Hello and uh, welcome to my channel. Uh, we are going to talk uh, today about how to get uh, the takeoff speeds uh, for the Phantom 300 uh, of the manual that comes with it, the performance manual. So uh, here we go, we will start with the, uh, and we have to decide first, uh, do we need uh, flaps 1, flaps 2? Uh, and the anti-ice is it on or off today the anti-ice will be off and the flaps settings uh, uh, our flaps settings will be uh, one uh, first we are need we are going to need some values the tra which is the distance available for takeoff you can uh, get it and get also the elevation we are going to need the elevation uh, of uh, the takeoff uh, runway and all of this we can get it from Navigraph charts that labeled uh, 10.9 so first we will go to the charts here we go the airport uh, and airport info takeoff minimums 10.9 we can uh, first get the elevation, which is here. The elevation is eight feet. Eight feet. We need the TORA distance of takeoff, which we can uh, find in the takeoff column here. And there is a reference number one, which is this one. Takeoff for uh, runway available. Uh, for runway, we are going to use runway 30 right. 30 right. So uh, from the threshold, we need we need the meter value. So here, it's uh, 3,653 meters. <coughs> so we we are done with this part. Now we are going to need uh, the temperature and the takeoff weight, which we can get uh, the temperature we can get from the ATIS, and the takeoff weight we can get it uh, after uh, we calculate the values. After we, we I mean, I mean, uh, after we enter uh, the fuel and uh, the weights for the aircraft so here we go first need the temperature from the ATIS Bahrain INTL information whiskey 400 Zulu weather wind 110 at 6 visibility more than 10 sky clear temperature 26 2.19 Altimeter so the temperature 2982. Is 26. And now we need the takeoff weight. <coughs> the takeoff weight you can do uh, you can get it after you set the ground options here. Uh, the left fuel tank, the right fuel tank, uh, uh, and uh, the pilot and passenger luggage. So our total mass mass is seven thousand. 65 so that's uh, we'll assume that, that that this is our takeoff weight now we will go to the charts the, the charts are in the manual folder that comes with the phantom 300 I mean the manual yes here we go so uh, as I said we are going to use flap one and the ice protection will be off our elevation is 8000 so here the this table is minus 1,000 feet 
uh, it suit us. If we are uh, more than 1,000 feet, there are some tables uh, till 14,000 feet. Uh, you can choose one of them. So this one for flaps one and under uh, 1,000 feet, we will uh, round our temperature 26. We have 25 here, but we can't use it. We will use uh, because our temperature 26, so we round it to the next upper uh, number, which is 30. So uh, 30, and our T or A is uh, 3,653, and the closest to it is 1,227 meters. So we are going to use this. Uh, so our V1 is 110, 110, we are 110, and uh, the V2 is 120, and the VFS, you can find it here under, is 138. Uh, by, by the way, you can use the VS uh, as a climb speed if one engine is not working. And our maximum takeoff weight for this one is 8,340 kg, kilograms. So uh, our right takeoff weight is 7,065. So we are okay. Our maximum takeoff weight is uh, 8,340. So we will go to the air uh, to the aircraft right now to enter uh, these values and here on the uh, V speeds so uh, our uh, V1 and VR is 110 V2 is 120 120 1, 1, and the VFS is 138 and that's it hope you enjoyed and learned something uh, thank you for listening and please don't forget to subscribe and like uh, this video thank you very much and see you again